Welcome back to my garage. We've got our workpiece and device. We've prepared our tools. Let's take a moment to talk about coolant. You have a couple of options for keeping the tools properly cooled. The first is called flood coolant. The second is called MQL or minimum quantity lubrication. Now my machine has flood. Flood coolant is great for materials that are ductile, work hard and easily, or have a difficult time dispersing heat. It's the standard in use today and works in pretty much all applications. Flood also ensures that the tool remains properly lubricated so that material does not build up on the cutting edge or in the flutes. It is also an excellent option for optimal surface finish as it clears pockets and profiles so that you're not recutting swarf or chips. This option is messy and it is recommended that you enclose the mill either with the Tormach enclosure or a DIY solution. For this option, you need a refractometer. Use this to ensure that the correct ratio of coolant to water is mixed. Also for flood coolant, an oil skimmer is highly recommended if the machine will sit for extended periods of time between uses, about three or more days. The oil skimmer removes tramp oil and agitates the coolant to prevent bacteria growth. It's best to run it after the tank has sat a while to let the oil separate from the coolant. The other option is MQL. Tormach offers the Fog Buster. Like flood coolant, MQLs work in most applications. The big upside to these is they require almost no maintenance. Just keep the reservoir full and use them. You also have greater visibility of what is actually being cut with this option. But they do have drawbacks. I don't find them as efficient for deep drilling or more heat sensitive materials. Okay, that's all I have for this video. I'll see you on the next one.